according to China Daily. China's aviation industry is working on the development of aircraft with short takeoff and vertical landing capabilities needed for an important role in the Chinese Navy's future operations, military experts said. Research and development on components of Stavl aircraft, such as the engine, have started, Wang Yanan, deputy editor-in-chief of Aerospace Knowledge magazine, told China Daily. The aircraft's principles are not new. They have been known for more than 40 years, so our aircraft designers should be able to develop the plane on their own, Wang said. The Aviation Industry Corp of China, the country's leading aircraft maker, announced on its website that two of its subsidiaries, Avic Chengdu Engine Group and China Aviation Engine Establishment, have signed a cooperation agreement on the development of the Stavl aircraft's engine. The statement said the Stavl aircraft project aims to strengthen the People's Liberation Army Navy's amphibious combat capability and address the absence of such a weapon in the PLA's arsenal. Compared with conventional fixed-wing aircraft, a Stavl plane can be readied for action in a shorter period of time and occupies less space in a hangar bay or on the deck of a ship. These features have made it a popular choice for naval powers since late 1960s when Britain's subsonic hawker Sidley Harrier became the first Stavl aircraft to be put in service. Almost all Stavl aircraft in active service are based on the Harrier design. This time, Avic appears to have made the right decision at the right time as the PLA Navy now needs a Stavl aircraft because it will significantly supplement and improve its amphibious capabilities, Wang said.